Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. Today, I uh, prove that I know more as a 25-year-old man than these silly kids do. We're voting for the Kids' Choice Awards. Here we go. Um, if you notice, things look a little different. That's because I'm doing this on my stream at Twitch twitch.tv slash Hunter King. And you could come here and check out all of the amazing stuff that I do. But for now, we are uh, we're voting on the Kids' Choice Awards. Um, and I will try and have limited opinions from the chat play into how I vote. Uh, we are starting off with your favorite kid show, favorite kid TV show. Um, I've never heard of this show. I know these shows, but I don't think they're good. This show is a reboot, and I haven't seen this, and I've kind of seen this, Raven's Home. Favorite family TV show. You know what? I think they'd understand because of Baby Yoda, but yeah, Mandalorian. Favorite reality TV show. Um... There's hands down one obvious winner here. It's not got America in the name or American. Does not involve Legos. Uh, it does involve masks. The Mask Singer. Watch it. It's so good. Favorite animated series. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. None of these. None of these. SpongeBob is past its prime. I love it, but past, past its prime. Alvin and the Chipmunks, I, I knew it existed, had no idea they were making, making episodes of it. Uh, Boss Baby back in business, no. Teen Titans Go gets hate, doesn't necessarily need it, but this is not the best show that's on Cartoon Network right now, and that's a fact. Lego Jurassic World, Legends of Isle Nublar, never heard of it. And then the, the the Loud House. The Loud House, I think, is the best option on here. Um, I think the show has done surprisingly good things for the Nickelodeon audience. Favorite female TV star? Uh, Ellie Anderson, never heard of her. Uh, Candace Cameron Burr from Fuller House. Eh. Uh, Raven Simone, Raven is home. Millie Bobby Brown, Stranger Things, Camille Mendez, Riverdale, Sophia Weil, High School Musical, The Musical, The Series. There was a show, I fell into watching it in high school, or not high school, in college. It was a, a very religious show for me, and there was an actress in that show that just was absolutely stunning. Um, and, man... I don't watch the show anymore because the writing just got atrocious. But, girl, if you ever, uh, you ever uh, around, just let me know. <laughs> Come here, Mendes. Uh, favorite male TV star: uh, Young Sheldon, Joshua Bassett from High School Musical: The Musical: The Series, Caleb McLaughlin from Stranger Things. Um, Dan Avidan from Stranger Things, Jace Norman, and then Dylan uh, Gimler from Young Dylan. Oh, I like Danny a lot. <sighs> Danny. Favorite movie. Favorite movie. We got Doolittle. We got Hamilton. We got Hubie Halloween. We got Mulan. We got Sonic the Hedgehog, and we got Wonder Woman 1984. Let me tell you, it makes my heart so happy that Hubie Halloween is on this list, but it does not need to be on this list at all, ever. I don't know why it is. Um, it comes down to two movies here. It comes down to two movies here, but we all know it's Sonic, and we all know that it's Sonic. <laughs> Favorite movie actress... 
Millie Bobby Brown, Enola Holmes, Anne Hathaway, Grand High Witch, The Witches. I'm I really like I don't want to butcher her name at all. Um the actress that played Mulan, so I'm not gonna do that um out of respect for her, but Mulan. Uh Gal Gadot from uh Wonder Woman, Vanessa Hudgens, Princesses from the Princess Switch and Switched Again, and then Melissa McCarthy as Carol Peters from Super Intelligence. Um, I think... I think it's Gal Gadot, honestly. I've just been informed it's Godot for the YouTube viewers. Favorite movie actor. Uh, so you got Jim Carrey as Dr. Robotnik in Sonic. Robert Downey Jr. as uh, John Doolittle. Lin-Manuel Miranda in Hamilton. Um, Adam Sandler as Hubie Dubois. Uh, Chris Bine as Steve Trevor, and then Will Ferrell as Lars Erickson, Eurovision Song Contest, The Story of Fire Saga. Um, it's Jim Carrey. It's Jim Carrey with the utmost respect to Lin Manuel Miranda. Uh, favorite animated movie Onward, The Crude's New Age, Scoob, Phineas and Ferb, The Movie, Candace Against the Universe, Trolls World Tour, and Soul. Okay. I have seen four of these movies. Um, I've not got to see Crude's New Age, nor probably will I. And I have not got to see Soul, um, but I heard pretty good things. Um, I don't think Phineas Ferb, the movie Candace Against the Universe, is the best in this group. I did enjoy it a lot, though. There is an incredible running gag that Buford has in that movie that you should check out if you have not seen it yet. Uh, Trolls World Tour. Um, I still don't know what the K in K-pop Trolls stands for. No one will tell me. So it's down to Scoob and Onward. And Gator, I'm sorry, but I'm probably going to go with Onward. All right, favorite voice from an animated movie. Okay, Tina Fey, 22 Soul, Jamie Foxx, Joe Gardner, Chris Pratt, Barley Lightfoot Onward, Anna Kendrick, Poppy, Ryan Reynolds is Guy, Emma Stone is Eep, Justin Timberlake is Branch, and then Zendaya is Michi. Um, Anna Kendrick, I have no problem. <laughs> Favorite female artist? Uh, Beyonce, Billie Eilish, Selena Gomez, Ariana Grande, Katy Perry, Taylor Swift. I think from this list the one that is my personal favorite of them is it's just it's me Jesse and Ari favorite male artist we got Justin Bieber Post Malone Harry Styles The Weeknd Sean Mendez and Drake it's not Drake it's not Sean I like Post but I don't think it's Post it's not Bieber it's between Harry Styles or The Weeknd I'm probably going Harry Styles favorite music group um, Black Eyed Peas, BTS, Maroon 5, Jonas Brothers, One Republic, Blackpink. I don't even care. Blackpink is in my area. Okay, favorite music collaboration. Be Kind, Marshmallow and Halsey, Ice Cream, Blackpink and Selena Gomez, Rain On Me, Lady Gaga, Ariana Grande, Stuck With You, Ariana Grande, and Justin Bieber, Lonely, Justin Bieber, Benny Blanco, Holy, Justin Bieber, and Chance the Rapper. This whole like side with Justin Bieber on it, get that out of here. Um, Rain on Me is an absolute banger and a half. All right, favorite song you got Yummy by Justin Bieber, Tootsie Slide by Drake, Cardigan, Taylor Swift, Blinding Lights, The Weeknd, Wonder, Sean Mendez, Dynamite, BTS, and without a doubt, without a doubt, the song on here that makes me go crazy and bop my head the most is hands down dynamite by bts hands down a favorite female social star emma chamberlain gamer girl charlie d'amelio addison ray maddie zeigler and easy easy choice here jojo siwa jojo keep doing your thing you're a gay icon and we love you for it Favorite male social star. Okay, James Charles, David Dobrik, Ryan's World, Jason Derulo, Mr. Beast, Ninja. 
Uh, it's not James Charles. It's not Jason Derulo. It's not Ryan's world for me. I know it's Mr. Beast, but like part of me wants to click David or Ninja. <laughs> but it's Mr. Beast. It, it's definitely Mr. Beast. Favorite female sports star. Simone Biles, Naomi Osaka, uh, Megan Rapine, I think is how you say it. I don't remember. Serena Williams, Candace Parker, Alex Morgan. Um, it's between Simone and Serena for me. I go Serena. All right, favorite male sports for, sports star. Okay, Tom Brady, Steph Curry, LeBron James, Patrick Mahomes, Lionel Messi, Russell Wilson. So, this is hard. This one is hard. I think I'm going Pat. I think I'm going Pat with the due respect in this instance to LeBron and Russ. I think I'm going Pat, though. He just loves ketchup, man. Favorite video game? Among Us, Animal Crossing New Horizons, Minecraft, Fortnite, Pokemon, Pokemon Go, Go to, to the, the Poles, pole. Roblox. It's not Roblox. I know that much. This is the one that I will do for the people. Because I have a lot of fun with Among Us, but I concede that Fortnite is the better game. I'm kidding. It's Animal Crossing New Horizons. <laughs> uh, and then your favorite global music star. You've got BTS representing Asia, Master KG representing Africa, Sebastian Yatar representing Latin America, Taylor Swift for North America, Savannah Clark for Australia, and then David Guetta for Europe. You know, on 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 a global scale, <gasps> oh, someone just made a great point. David Guetta. David Guetta ended racism. Guys, that's it. That's it. That's the Kids' Choice Awards. We voted. Um, I know more than children know. Um, if you don't vote exactly how I voted, then you're probably dumb. And that's just how it goes. Uh, that's the whole video, though. Bye.